We started answering one challenge with the discovery of a way to make skewed permanent magnet fields, believing that it was the way to make a permanent magnet motor. Many have had the same belief before. Perpetual motion at a critical speed. Resonance with an energy to compensate for friction. Energy from a bob here, from a spring in a watch. Magnets power the more recent art. Logarithmic decay. 92% of height is recovered for every bounce. Rebounding, the ball gets cooler from viscoelastic effects. Adding two tiny magnets decreases the number of clicks and increases the number of swings. Run this experiment yourself if you want to see more proof. Ponder the bow with and without an arrow. Same energy connecting the string to the trigger for both. Very different energy out. Where does the energy go to the arrow to heat and to non-heat decay? Compare the resonance to a piano string. We did not have a clue about non-heat, but we knew permanent magnet energy could be harvested. We gave up trying to invent another clock. We moved on to defining common attributes of engines with internal and external combustion. Aha! Clocks, bows, and heat engines all have cycles defined by switches. In these clocks, resonance from crystals regulate the frequency. Negligible heat and non-heat losses. Transistors are the switches. No clicks because there are no mechanical boundaries. Resonance is the speed barrier for clocks. Heat engines need a different speed barrier. Watt invented this to make an energy barrier for his steam engine. Output is technically limited, not conserved. Only conserved for two reactions happening at the exact same time, like perfect resonance. This invention limits fuel before it is burned. A magnet motor has attraction and repulsion at different times. A piston engine is very different from a turbine. Pressure on moving boundary pistons versus centripetal force on moving boundary curved surfaces. Logarithmic decay is called stages in turbines. Stages to define a complete cycle. Just one stage for pistons. Valves for the pistons are antique prior art. Switching between stator and rotor vanes requires no steel. Stages for turbines be, by definition occur at different times. The pertinent attribute here for all of our technology is that there is no energy barrier between opposing veins. Hindsight is better than being blind. Our goal was the simple monopole dream, maybe how Davenport started. Attraction approaching a magnet stator and repulsion while emerging at a different time. Simple if three magnets did not interact independently. On about our fifth try, we came up with this surprise. On one side only attraction, on the other side attraction and repulsion. Non-heat decay is the only weapon capable of destroying the barrier. No oil burned on the other side. A battle worth fighting. Much of the earth needs water fit to drink. A tiny magnet motor pump with a paper filter to catch guinea worms is where we would start to solve that problem. Our tiny magnet motor will be added to the list next. Megawatt generators will be added soon after the 10kW models. Impulse power to clean up the debris so Kyla can pick up some moon rocks to sell might take another year. In the next free class, we will present the prior art equations for balloons and Newton's cradle. Then we will empty the trash, starting with the four natural forces. My key de Vilma rules for arguing. Fighters without equations will not be allowed in the ring. Oil stained earth zealots might want to check the trash for impotent equations before they decide to fight. Our presentation here might be deemed silly. 
fit for a party, but not fit to challenge zealots to a fight. Our equations say that we might never get 5KW with magnets that many people can afford. Magnet motors are just a stepping stone for us. Prior art failures without non-heat have never worked for 360 degrees. We have hand-carved magnets now, made with diamond saws. Can you guess the shape? Now we have ordered enough magnets for five motors, and we wait. The remaining standing zealots, when those magnets are assembled, might say no mas, like Roberto, but quicker.